hello people welcome to my youtube channel in this video we are going to discuss about how to create a variance for pcb so as you can see there are few not fitted components that means those component will be uh, not going to assemble in our pcb design while testing or while operation so i will show you how to remove those component from the bomb and create a simple variance for that so that means if you uh, uh, like uncheck that variant or just select the without variant option then those component will be included and if you select the variant option then those component will be removed from BOM from your PCB uh, component placement from your PCB 3D view uh, from assembly drawing from everywhere right so but before going further here I just want to show you guys how you guys can order your first zero dollar PCB from nextpcb.com and how you can apply five dollar coupon so click over the first link given in the description register yourself with your official mail id if you guys have already registered just click over the login and fill your mail id and password and there are just after the registration you will give uh, you'll get a five dollar coupon right now I will show you how you can order your zero dollar PCB 10 number of quantities go to the home fill all the dimensions of your PCB select the quantity to 10 go to the code now and here fill all the information select the first option with zero dollar select your country and select the local China post mail and then you can sell you can able to select either you want to order assembly or not add your GABA files and here you'll see this screen for GABA verification after that you'll get mail from the sales team and here you can see the five dollar coupon you have applied and you can order your 10 number of pcbs just 11 dollars so guys just proceed the payment and now we can continue our tutorial uh, how to create a variance so just uh, right click over the project and there you will find option variance left click on it and you'll see this option here we'll click over add variance so the variance name will be variant of stm blue pill i will allow the variance for the fabrication output and click over OK and here you can see the components variation is available so now if I right click over here and set as fitted non fitted and alternate so these are three options and I can choose any one of these right so I'm just going to place the not fitted component the first one is C7 so just select it not fitted so by default it is fitted okay another component is c3 we'll select the c3 and make it not fitted similarly we can add the alternate part number of also c4 not fitted and another component is this j2 so search for j2 this and make it not fitted okay right now i'll click over okay button and here you can see there is a two option available one is the variant of this and another is no variant similarly when we'll open the output job file let's open the with folder structure so simply you can see uh, here we have two options the variant of stm and then if you generate the bomb these three components will be not uh, not there so let's see so the components are uh, c7 c3 and c4 let's see these are there on the bomb or not okay so see there is no c3 c7 and c4 on the bomb right those are removed so uh, this is how we uh, create the variant uh, Similarly, I can show you on the 3D model also, but uh, I have to import the changes, I guess. So here, if I select the variant of STM blue pill 3, uh, I'll flip the PCB. Yeah, so you can see these C7, C4 and uh, C3. These three capacitors are not fitted and this uh, uh, six pin connector is also not fitted. But here, if I select the no variant double click on it and those components will be fitted right so this is very useful uh, tool and uh, obviously we create variants for uh, uh, many controller design to make design uh, generalize so yeah